Hey everyone, I got eyelash extensions and I am so excited to share with you guys my experience with them. So if you're interested in seeing my experience and, and kind of like my tips for care and wear that I learned from this process, this whole uh, um, eyelash extension experience, just keep on watching. So I am about to get my lashes uh, done everyone and so I want to show you guys what they look like before. Uh, Hey everyone, so I don't know if you guys can tell the difference of my lashes are on now. Um, Hernan thinks they're too long, but I the like side, them. Side view. side view? I don't know if you guys can tell. But I already have long lashes. Um, the length, honestly, is not that much bigger. Um, she added a few, I want to remember this correctly. So she says that um, she, she was going to originally put just the uh, 15. 15, so I don't know however long that is. 15 what? I don't know. She was originally going to add the 15s on, but when she saw my lashes, um, she says that my lashes are very similar to the 15s as far as length. So she still added 15s for a little bit more volume, but she also added 16s for some length so it'll look like I actually have more versus if I had just curled my lashes. Because I do have pretty decently long lashes to begin with. I just... I wanted more and I want some I wanted to look where I want to look presentable without really having to wear makeup and that is why I got these so I'm so excited she's super super sweet um, I'll definitely link her information if you guys are interested down below but um, yeah so for care I'm not supposed to wet them um, try not to wet them for two days. So I have to be very careful as far as when I'm showering and cleaning my face. Um, she says that one day is good, but two days is uh, better. So I'm gonna do my very best for that. So I'm gonna I'm gonna try not to put a lot of eye makeup as long, like on my lids um, to try to minimize how much I'm gonna be cleaning um, around the eye area. But um, I will do a follow up video like I told you guys in a week and in two weeks, so you guys can see my progress. Good morning, everyone. You guys don't know it's morning. <laughs> it is morning. I'm actually getting ready for work. And I wanted to do an update. I originally thought I was going to just do my first impressions for this lash look. And it didn't work out that way. So I decided I'm just going to make one video of my first impressions. And as the week progresses. So I'm going to show you guys um, as the day go days go by how my lashes are working out so far. So I'm going to bring you in a little bit. So this is what um, they look like. I am obsessed with these. So this is the second day um, that I wear them. And so far, uh, I love them. The maintenance isn't honestly horrible. Um, so I really, really like them so far. The only thing is today I did wear mascara on my bottom lashes. And my bottom lashes are not the longest, but they are not that short either. So they're kind of like curling on the inside but um I just need to make sure that I pull this one down and I'm fine uh so I love these so much so far um I will talk to you guys about the care and everything but I just wanted to show you guys today what they look like at day two day three I got them on Sunday today's Tuesday so yeah today's already with them Ooh, like that okay so I will see you guys in a couple days Bye, you guys. So I'm not sure exactly everything that I had filmed in the beginning So I, when I first got them. So I was so excited to get them because I wanted something that I can put on and not really have to worry about, you know, having to do much in the mornings. And so this was more of an experiment, experiment for myself, and I actually really, really enjoyed it. Um, I did my research, though, going in. Before I got them, I knew what it took to kind of maintain them something that you have to kind of know going in what to expect from them they're not magic you guys and it does take a little bit of work you know to apply them it's not something that you can just put them on set them and forget them kind of thing you do have some maintenance for them um i actually found my girl at um i saw this girl walking around and she had these beautiful lashes on and i was like oh my god like are those yours? Are the extensions? And if they're extensions, where did you get them? Like they were gorgeous. So um, this girl um, led me to um, 
Another girl, she's on Instagram as Petals Inc, I believe it's called, and I will list all in her information um, down below for her Instagram and stuff. And I really wanted to check her out because her work is beautiful, you guys. And she's in the LA area. And I know someone else that does lashes, but she's a little further away from me. So I was, I wanted someone that was more local and I was lucky to find her. Um, she's super, super sweet. And the whole process took less than two hours. She does like to book you for about two hours, but it took a little bit less, maybe about an hour and a half for the whole experience or the whole, you know, lash um, installation. And when I first got them, they were so beautiful. They were more like, like a wispy. Um, I got the hybrid mix and I honestly was so excited with them. And they still look good. This is honestly, I'm going on two and a half weeks with these lashes. And if you guys can tell, like, I still have some. This one, I do follow, I sleep on this side, so they are a little bit um, more sparse, like a few of them have, I've lost some of them. But honestly, you guys, you lose lashes anyways in general, so I, I knew that going in. So don't think that you're never going to lose lashes, like your lashes fall off. I, I don't know, because I wear mascara, so I know like every single day that I put mascara on before, like I would have an, a lash or two fall off. So it's something that I knew going in as well. Um, I think they're fabulous, so now for care. Um, for care, I was told to try not to get them wet for two days. So what I did, like she likes two days as more of a precaution just so they'll stay on a little bit better. And so I went in knowing that. So I, I washed my face. I put no makeup on my face. Um, that day that I went in, I showered before going to see her. And then at night, I did wash with a cloth and just carefully washed around my lashes. The next day, I did the same exact thing. I didn't wear makeup for two days and I didn't wear heavy um, lotions for two days just because I wanted to um, minimize like the cleaning that I had to do around my face. I did shower, you guys. Um, for the shower, what I would do is I have... Um, like a, I have a, a shower head that comes off. So I would like um, wash my body and then um, with just like unattached, like detach the shower head. And then I would put it back on and I would carefully put soap on my face and on my forehead. And then with my hands, I would wash it off versus like putting my face in the shower. So I would um, minimize how wet that would get. Um, about uh, Three days ago, four days ago, I totally forgot I had the lashes on and I like threw water on my lashes like directly, like I just put my head in the shower and I was like, oh my goodness, I totally forgot about it. So what I did was like, I, I would kind of comb them down and then when I got out, I, um, I just uh, blow dried it facing up with cold air and they're fine only this one like there's one that um it's kind of like sideways a little bit and so just kind of being mindful of how you sleep if you're someone that sleeps really heavily on your eyes they might bend a little bit like i know my lashes in general aren't the shortest they're a little bit long so when i do sleep i rem remember that like some of my lashes would kind of fold and it's the same thing usually the way your lashes sit is the way that they're gonna sit with the extensions as well so just keeping that in mind i had one lash that always goes down and the same thing happened like as soon as i got my lashes that one would go down I honestly pulled that one out because I don't like that lash and I always do pull that lash out because it's just, that's my little rogue lash. But um, yeah, that's pretty much it for care, I think. I have another friend that gets lashes done and she says that she likes to wear an eye mask and I've heard that there's people that wear um, uh, to sleep and then I've heard that there's people that wear goggles to shower just to minimize um, how wet your lashes get. If you wear the goggles and the mask, maybe they'll last longer that way. I don't know because I didn't try that out myself. But um, I truly loved this experience. I don't know if I'm going to get a refill. I might just let them um, grow out just because I have... Uh, it's not going to fit in with my plans at this moment that I have going on. But... Um, I definitely um, will plan on getting them again another day, but not in the near future just because of my plans, but nothing to do with the lashes. These lashes are fantastic. I love them. I highly recommend um, the girl that I went to, so I definitely, again, will link her information down below. 
if you guys have any questions i hope i was thorough i'm not sure um oh and i do she, she does give you i forgot she gives you a brush that i don't know where i had it but she gives you a spoolie and to brush them out so it's good like in the mornings to kind of brush them out to fan them out so that they're not really stuck together but um yeah i think that is it any questions that you guys have like i said leave them down below and thank you guys so much for watching if you're not subscribed and you liked my channel please hit the thumbs up and have a beautiful day you guys bye